All right, Christina, I'm sold. I want to buy one. How much is it going to cost me? Oh, God. Look at this amazing aircraft behind us that we're about to find all about. So, Christina, tell us a bit about your role at Pivotal. So I'm the Chief Operating Officer at Pivotal. I've been with the company for the past nine years, where I help design the propulsion systems, yeah. build up the manufacturing and design teams, and also now lead the flight organization. Mm. And I happen to be one of the pilots. Yeah, the that's good. So how do you actually become a pilot of one of these aircraft when they're so new to the market? So we actually had to design the training program ourselves. Uh, so this is not a certified aircraft, and the training program is not certified. Mm. It also doesn't operate like a traditional fixed wing or like a helicopter. Yeah. It's quite different. It has eight different propulsion systems, yep. eight different control surfaces, and one inceptor. So that one inceptor is controlling the aircraft through a fly-by-wire system, which means that it's connected with data and information as opposed to mechanical systems to control the aircraft. Now that would be way too much for someone to be able to control within their brain. So we have flight computers and we have three yep. of them. So these are the brains of the aircraft. What it does is it takes all the information from the sensor suite of the aircraft and then it translates that through our state estimators and our flight controllers to be able to understand which way is forward and what the pilot would like to command. Uh, to be able to make this aircraft fun, safe, and easy to fly. So of course this aircraft being actually electric, what is the flight size that you're getting? Yeah, so the aircraft is actually only 348 pounds, so it's within the ultralight category here in the U.S. It's 254 pounds plus amphibious systems and safety systems, mm -hmm. and that includes all the batteries. So we have an 8 kilowatt battery. This is tiny. Uh, so the aircraft is able to fly 20 miles with that 8 kilowatts, and that's because you don't have road noise like you yeah. would on the ground, uh, and it flies very efficiently. So that can get you around your property. It can get you sometimes to work or into the, the outskirts of town. That's so a lot nice. of our different customers are using it in different ways and finding yeah. that that's a really awesome um ability to be able to get in the air. It's everyone's dream to have something that they can just take off in their front yard. What's the sales looking like on these aircraft? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you saw with the Jetsons decades ago that this type of technology is something people have always wanted. So we have an early access program that we launched last year where we delivered our first aircraft in June of last year. And we've delivered a handful in the US over the course of the last year, yeah. uh, as well as eight to the US Air Force. So there's actually single seat aircraft. How does someone actually train in one of those? Yeah, great question. Uh, so we designed in tandem with this aircraft a full-fledged flight simulator oh, wow. that actuates. We have them over here. Uh, yeah. that you see you're welcome to try them. They're extremely fun and very, very similar to actual real flying. So that your first time in the aircraft, you actually feel really comfortable. Been there before. So comparing this to a helicopter's ongoing maintenance, what is the maintenance costs and efficiency to run compared to a helicopter? Yeah, it's actually quite different. So this aircraft is electrically powered, so you can power it off of a 120 volt uh, inside your house. And it has electric propulsion systems right here. So these are custom designed by Pivotal, uh, and it actually is very simple. It's two components. There's a yeah. rotor that spins and a stator that's stationary, and they don't have a maintenance uh, yeah. cost associated with them. So over the course of a year, maybe you'd replace some propellers, but that'd be a, on the order of uh, a couple hundred dollars. All right, Christina, I'm sold. I want to buy one. How much is it going to cost me? So this aircraft sells for 190000 Oh, wow. Um, and it's uh, in production right now. All right, I don't have 190000 with me at the moment, but is there any way I can actually experience the flight? Absolutely. We've got two simulators here that are the real simulators that we train yeah. our customers to fly on. So we'd oh, love yeah. to get you on board. Oh, yeah, I'll do that. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Uh, so this is the app that you would see on your phone that connects with the aircraft. So the aircraft can communicate with you when you're not even in the aircraft. So when you're sitting yeah. at home, you can open up this app and you can see the, the state of charge of the aircraft. Uh, and you do all your pre-flight checks right here. So what do we actually have on this screen? So this is the flight deck. So this is where the aircraft inside the cockpit is communicating with the pilot. So you can see where your position is, what mode you're in up here. So this is uh, the way that you can interact with how you're actually flying in real time. This is the simulator that we use to train flight testers and customers how to fly the Helix. It flies 95% accurate to the real thing. Now, the Helix has two modes. The first is cruise, where it flies like a plane. The second is hover mode, where it flies a bit more like a helicopter. And I'm gonna activate your chair. Oh. All right, and you're off. Now, keep coming forward on the rocker. This is your altitude control, and we're going up. Right. Oh, gosh. Okay, you are in hover, and the default is that you are hanging still in the air, additionally. If you bend the joystick in any direction, forwards, backwards, left and right, your helix will go in that direction. That was amazing. If the viewers want one, where will I find you? What's the website? So, 
You go to pivotal.aero. Yeah. So that's www.pivotal.aero. You will find all the information about how to customize your aircraft, how to learn from different customers who are actually flying it, uh, where you can call us anytime yeah. uh, and you can get someone from the company actually answering questions. Thanks so much for saying amazing aircraft. Thank you.